All right, we'll go on. See you next time. So, transgender hate mail, homosexual hate mail, atheist hate mail. Basically, we react to a bunch of screen caps on YouTube. Do you know any sponsor comments? I'm really against the DM lifestyles. Uh, trigger warning. Mm. You don't like what I'm saying? Then go ahead and click off the video. Mm, don't lie. So there's hate speech in my videos because there isn't any. Uh, so you want here? No, it's, it's, it's you hate the speech. I'm, uh, you know, what I'm saying. That speech you hate, not hate speech. You know, that's the difference. Mm, okay, mm, let's continue on here. Mm. Uh, people getting anything wrong? Me trying to straighten them out. Uh, go. Uh, let's see here. Uh, never give up. I was just born too short of my body mm, because of lies. Uh, my transition to a taller body that reflects the height that I am in my head it was a long, painful process of lies. <clears throat> People along the way told me that I was insane for getting artificial limb extensions. Mm, yeah, that's not necessary. And that I should just accept myself as I naturally am, because that's what is in reality. Mm. They don't know what it's like to look in the mirror and see all that empty space that I know in my head should be filled with me. Mm. <laughs> yeah, someone's got an excused oh, viewpoint there. Mm. Yeah, well, nine o'clock alarm there. Very nice. A skewed viewpoint of the, their, how their bodies work. Now I look over those. Mm, read more. Mm, mm. And someone says, I spent so many nights dreaming about these one time transition, those one time transition pills. I spent so many nights coming to peace with the drawbacks of never being comfortable in skin. And yet the pain is deeper than any physical pain can ever be. Mm, it's mental pain. Mm, yeah, spiritual pain. Mm. It casts an overly shadow on the protective of post transition life, which should be the ultimate paradise of bullcrap. Yes, it is. It is all bullcrap. Continue on. The worst part is that there isn't even anyone to blame. You just happen to come out wrong. No refunds. So like I say, no. You know, like I say, you did not come out wrong. The feeling is wrong. The stereotype is wrong. Wrong. Because that's what's going on here. Have to come out wrong. I'm like that. What? With a perfectly functional body that 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 that, that works just fine. You know, but it's wrong because um, I don't like that. I you know, I don't I don't like having to deal with this normal stuff that everyone who has a body like mine has to deal with. Like yeah, too bad. Like wow, how could you say that? Because like, it's normal stuff you have to learn to live with. It's like, I don't want to. I'm like, too bad. Mm, you have to. I'm just like, oh. I heard people can, you know, get the chemicals in their bodies that, that stop that stuff from happening. I'm like, yeah, but that's not good. That's that's, uh, that's dangerous. It's unhealthy. Mm. But I don't want to do that. Oh, my God, too bad. Mm. Mm, that's what you get. You know, that is the shape you get. That is the size you get. That is the color you get. Those are the amount of organs you get. Mm. Got to learn to live with them. Mm. Let's go. Let's continue on here. And I, as someone says, I thought about this a lot. The video made me realize that it's not just bad thoughts, and it really will happen. And I'll never be comfortable in skin. I can't even have my own bio kids. Surgery and hormones will cost a lot. You will be envious, and I'll just never get to experience the same thing as comfortable skin guys. They gonna come to peace with it. Mm, with these lies. Mm, yeah. <laughs> just one of the worst things ever. I've seen people say that they come to peace with lies. Mm, oh my gosh. Mm, get that out of here. Mm. You know, someone said, you will never be comfortable with skin gender. I was not ready for that. I wish I was born a country skin girl every day. Like that. Hearing it from you made it all the more real. Mm. I say, a girl who wants to be a boy never will become a boy ever. <laughs> but will do everything she can to try and lie and say she is. Mm. Yeah, get out of here. And I say, actually, he is real and he is amazing. It's for you, like, you don't listen to it. Mm. Why are you just use that one? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, what I say, yes, it's cute, but all the crazy guy, but all some crazy guy writing a book and uh, writing in a book, it's cute and all, but some crazy guy writing in a book is still evidence unless it's a crazy guy I like. Mm -hmm. like I say, unless it's a crazy guy or a girl, you're saying what you want to hear. They totally helps. Mm -hmm. Someone said, nice, you owned yourself. Like I'm proud of you. Are you getting this far, stranger? Smiley face. Mm -hmm. Colon smiley. You know, bracket smiley face. And I said, actually, you owned yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you did, because you basically said, they basically said, you know, the crazy guy writing a book, you know, you know, ignore that fact that we have crazy guys who write books all the time that we like, mm -hmm. you know. Richard Dawkins is saying, like, yeah, thinking people, you know, accept that there is no God because they're thinking, mm -hmm. you know, about what, mm -hmm. you know, they're looking, mm -hmm. they're thinking, mm -hmm. you know, thinking wrong. <laughs> uh, I say, I'm telling the truth. Well, what's not wearing his clothing? You remember what was clothing? Because Lord your God tests him who does this. Uh, you read more. Mm -hmm. So it's like, your God's God loves me, even though I'm trans. Yes, but you're doing wrong. You gotta stop. Mm -hmm. This is wrong with that nice stuff. Stop lying about your Michael sex. Mm -hmm. You're going off the translated book instead of the word of glory himself, which can happen, you know, God can speak to people directly, but he says a lot of things in the Bible, and you have to work on that. What we have here is a Christian who 
does not fall, does not believe in the Bible. Mm, that's bad. Because mm, I really as well. The Bible is our instruction manual. We must follow it. Mm, you know. That was kind of dumb to me because uh, I'm not getting the wisdom of God in my body, inside my mind, through reading the studying the Bible. I'm just going off stuff I think what was told is you know the the, the words of God, you know, and the, some of those feelings and things I, I was told the word of God are not. You know, lying about stuff is not from God. <laughs> the transitional lifestyle is not from God. Get that out of here. I say, so you're saying that the Bible is not the word of God? Also, it does love you, but it does not like lying. I say to this person. Most likely a dude. Next. Well, I say, perhaps it's the stereotype of what your birth sex is rather than your birth sex as a follow. Uh, so I say, well, what makes you want to have your sex body? Fear sounds more possible, you know, because they're trying to say hormone stuff is what's causing you to lie about your body. It's like, oh, androgen. You know, there's, there's, there's t estrogen, testosterone, and androgen. Mm -hmm. Androgen. Mm -hmm. The heck is androgen? Mm -hmm. You know, it makes you uh, non-binary. <laughs> like, uh, mm -hmm. Estrogen, testosterone. I can understand influencing a person's mood mm -hmm. because estrogen, of course, is a female hormone, so it makes a person more emotional in certain ways. But testosterone is a male hormone, so it makes you more emotional in a different way, mm -hmm. in some ways, too. Mm -hmm. You know, definitely more anger and mm -hmm. stuff like that because, of course, it's testosterone. Mm -hmm. But androgen, mm -hmm. a thing that does what? Makes you less emotional? Mm -hmm. Bull crap. Mm -hmm. Please write in the comments. Mm -hmm. Tell me what androgen is supposed to do. Mm -hmm. Bull crap. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, and here he goes, person. Says, he will cause it's not the hormone itself. What the heck does it do? Mm -hmm. Why is it a thing? Mm -hmm. It's like I said in my previous response. It's the body's sensitivity or insensitivity to androgen that causes people to feel as though they do not belong within the binary. Mm -hmm. oh, bull crap. Mm -hmm. Bull crap. Mm -hmm. Please thoroughly read my response of lies mm -hmm. and as I do not want to argue over a point I've already stated I'm not scared of my sex you know, I understand that isn't something I could change and I've made my speech of that I'm discovering disgust yes but it's not fear you know, discovering disgust through lies of course fear of what happens mm -hmm. what could happen to me mm -hmm. that becomes discovering disgust mm -hmm. you know I was like oh no I gotta do that again oh no mm -hmm. I can't do that why can't I do that mm -hmm. you know because you can't mm -hmm. you know dang it mm -hmm. you know what was my life gonna be like because of that like, uh, a little bit different mm -hmm. you know, not not bad mm -hmm. I say I'm not to discuss but not fear mm -hmm. I say then why hide it why lie about it like I don't lie about it you lie about it all the time mm -hmm. you know, I don't also go running around telling people constantly what my sex is because likely it's relevant to the conversation so you hide it mm -hmm. yeah. there's an important distinction that you need to understand between sex and gender sex is what we're born with and does not change gender is how our bodies are aligned bullcrap mm -hmm. Gender is what you like and don't like. Mm -hmm. Gender is identity. You know, it's not biology. Mm -hmm. you know, it's uh, me mental. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like I'm explaining this well, you know, according to the lies I was told. Mm -hmm. I won't respond to you. I'll tell you, you educate, mm -hmm. you know, read more. Mm -hmm. I say, if you don't believe that sex can change, then why bother trying to change it? Why hide it from people? Why well, say you're the opposite? Well, you're saying that identity is unique to each person, but human bodies are not. Mm -hmm. So... Uh, and so it's, I guess, every butch lesbian is a trans man now, now too. The versatility of age traits equals gender to you. <laughs> they are. Mm -hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. That has nothing to do with that, bud, because I, I was told lies. It doesn't. Mm -hmm. It has to do with how the brain is literally structured through lies. Mm -hmm. Cry about it. Uh, cry about our lies. Like, no. Mm -hmm. In ways I will. Because, mm -hmm. my gosh. Mm -hmm. You guys listen. Boy, you guys release some crap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, someone said, that's what I'm saying. Personality does not equal gender. It, it's it, personality obviously equals gender because uh you know i say i'm more i f i feel like i'm more like a man than a woman and some other people said they're more like a woman than a man <laughs> you know so personality does equal gender but it doesn't because you know, i don't want them to be right the people who say the personality is gender to be right <laughs> you know that's all i got <laughs> you know you're talking to the wrong person. As I said, non binary isn't real since now your brain is not is I have characteristic traits that are based on you uh, you, you you think mm -hmm. and act. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Okay, and you're missing the fact that the brain can be structured directly in the middle of male and female, making like them neither. Mm, brain speaking. Mm, you're not very bright, are you? Mm, that's also, it's non binary. The gender binary. Binary means two. Binary to left and put off. Mm, no. Mm, duh. Mm, I can't read that. Don't cuss, I can't read that word. 